beauties welcome back to my channel so today I wanted to do a store haul um, specifically a Target store haul I've done just one store haul on this channel and I'm not sure why I hadn't sit sat down to do like any more since then but uh, I wanted to do a Target one uh, as most of you should know I'm just really into affordable products and sharing different affordable finds with you guys so I just I will get better at doing some store hauls uh, and I wanted to start off before the haul though and just thank you guys for 2,000 subscribers like that is so cool um, I didn't know like when I would reach that milestone but it's been pretty much like a year and a half since I've started um, beauty vlogging and doing like my lifestyle talks and things here on YouTube and so it's pretty cool to reach this milestone after that amount of time I focus on subscribers somewhat of course but my main thing was just to keep progressively getting better in my channel that's like my main thing and then I feel like the rest should kind of follow. However, I do appreciate anyone I've ever told about my channel that has come through and hit that subscribe button and has actually watched a video or a few videos and tries to keep up here and there when they can. I really, really do appreciate that. Pretty much I'm doing like a social media giveaway uh, just to say a little thank you. And I'm not sure exactly um, like when but just be on the lookout because that'll be soon I have a couple ideas on things I want to give away I may give like two things either two of the same or a first and second place prize I'm not sure but my main thing was just to say thank you for 2,000 subbies and I hope you enjoy this haul okay so I'm starting with the makeup products that I had to re-up on and there's probably a couple that I hadn't tried but um, most of them are items that I've used and I loved and I just wanted to re-up on them pretty much yeah so pretty much this elf mascara I'm not gonna pull it out at this moment but maybe I'll be able to pull up a picture or something for you guys but uh, pretty much it has just a unique brush um, that they've designed for you to be able to get in the inner corners of your eyelashes and just really get that reach and open up your eyes as much as possible when applying your mascara so I, that's why that's the most reason why I really love this 3-in-1 Limpin Define and Volumize Mascara by e.l.f. and then like my second favorite that I always pick up um, is this e.l.f. Studio Makeup Mist and Set Spray it's perfect. Um, it's like, it's just with aloe, green tea, cucumber, vitamins A, C, and E. And it's, it's a really, really good everyday use setting spray um, just to make sure that you have just a little more of a longer lasting makeup and stay with your makeup uh, and that your makeup doesn't fade as quickly throughout the day. This is a really good everyday setting spray and it only costs three bucks. So yeah. And then I went ahead and picked up two of their glow bronzers. Uh, I have the warm tan and the sun kissed. Okay, next. I guess I'm kind of going by brands a little bit, at least for the makeup part. Uh, I picked up this Maybelline New York Fit Me Matte and Poreless Foundation, and it's in. This is 355 um, coconut is what they call it. Uh, I've been using Fit Me, the Fit Me line since they put out the just Fit Me. Maybelline New York liquid foundation from the beginning. I tried it out, used it, loved it because I felt like that this line of liquid foundation actually has like the shades 
pretty close to right over a lot of the companies, um, especially when it comes to like the darker skin tone. And then I got the Maybelline Define and Fill Duo. This is a brow um, by iStudio. Uh, it's in deep brown, number 260. I'll list all the products in the description though. And um, this is a Maybelline just brow duo. It's like a pencil you can fill in and then you would use, um, it's a defining pencil and then a filling powder actually. This Stay Matte Primer by Ramon London. It's really, really good and effective and will at least um, give you a matte finish and look for, you know, some odd hours before you feel like, okay, you know, your makeup's getting dewy or that your face is feeling like oily from your foundation, especially like those liquid foundations and things. So, recommend it. I picked up some cleansing towelettes um, for my makeup remover and washing away my makeup before I actually use my skincare system that I use, which is Proactive Plus. I have a video on that as well. Uh, so these are exfoliating wipes. I really, really like these. Um, the brand, it says like up and up. Uh, it's, a, it's probably like just the Target brand. And it just says, um, it actually, there's like 30. Yeah, 30 in each. I got a cucumber and an apricot. I love Skin Tement Moisturizing uh, Shaving Cream in the Raspberry Rain. Smells delicious. It's a really thick, foaming, like, cream. Pretty much shaving cream. And it's like, it smells good. It, it's, it's, it seems really protecting over the skin. Uh, like, because like I said, it's like, it's not just some airy foam. It's kind of like a thicker foam, which I like. I like that. So I really love this one. And then of course, I had run out of razors as well. So I went and this is actually up and up brand razors too. I just gravitate towards anything that's like, I guess the knockoff brand of things because I mean, why not? It's the same thing and you're saving like a dollar or so, especially if you're like buying a bulk of things that day. So this is a five blade, five blade razor. So it's, and it's five of them. So this is a good deal. I believe it maybe was only like $6 or something like that maybe. Um, and it says, um, you can compare it to Venus, the Venus Embrace razors so and I it's the same thing I actually was just getting low on my body wash and I tried like the St. Ives body wash and I think it was like maybe like a berries cream one uh, and I just love anything with like coconut in it now uh, I really don't I don't know for a long time I hated coconut I didn't like the smell I, you know, now I, I love the raw, undefined coconut um, oil, and you know, it's good to cook with, and it's good for your hair, and I actually now enjoy the smell. So anyways, I got this indulgent coconut milk, St. Ives, body wash, and this is a Body Ecology Cherish the Moment exfoliating sugar scrub, and it smells delicious here we go let me come on sugar uh, smells delicious and it's just really effective I love 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 to use an exfoliating scrub for like your elbows just those areas that just tend to be really dry and ashy looking I mean I just really gotta get in there on your like the knees elbows and then go ahead and work it all around you know as you're as i'm in the shower or whatnot and it just leaves a really good lingering smell and then also kind of your skin feels a bit resurfaced but these cotton balls this is 200 count up and up brand here again like i said i guess it's like a target target brand 
Walgreens has like their brands like that. Um, and then I got this, these cotton rounds, which I love. Um, I use the cotton balls more so for like, I like them more so to remove nail polish. Um, yeah, more so to like remove that. You can also use the cotton rounds too. So yeah, that was my target run yesterday and I just wanted to share that. So I hope you guys enjoyed that. Go ahead and let me know if you've tried any of these products. Um, if you'd like to try any of these products after watching the video, ask me any questions. And thank you for watching. I will catch you in my next video. Bye.